Hello everybody, this is Toko Explorer. I'm today in Frankfurt, Germany and I'm going to review the Lufthansa uh, Business Class Lounge. You might be wondering, what's, what's going on here? This is not a priority pass lounge. So, but if you are a holder of an American uh, Express Platinum car, you can basically um, enter Lufthansa lounges um, if you fly with Lufthansa. Okay, just a quick um, explanation here. I wanted to go into this lounge, but I changed my mind because the guy at the welcome desk told me they don't have any warm options and uh, I better go to the business class lounge, which is closer to gate 18. Okay, welcome from inside the Lufthansa lounge here at Frankfurt Airport. Before I start my lounge review, let's clean my hands. Lufthansa, um, they have these big packages of um, um, hand disinfection wipes. I grabbed a few items from the from the buffet. Um, which is uh, they have warm options they have a few snacks and I um, um, ordered um, a, a soup and then meatballs I have a dessert and I have German potato salad and um, so and um, of course a few drinks but let's start off this lounge review with um, um, uh, sparkling wine cheers That's refreshing. I have to uh, keep a low profile here because the lounge is quite full. Yeah, let's start with the um, with the soup, and um, this is a cauliflower um, soup, cauliflower cream soup. Mm -hmm. As the main um, dish, they have um, the vegetable rice with a tomato sauce and. Um, Meatballs. Mm -hmm. So, guys, that's the Bailey's. Mm. I really like, I like the glasses with this Lufthansa logo here. Um, they have the same logo on the um, wine. Um, champagne glasses. Though it's not champagne, it's sparkling wine. They don't have champagne, they have Prosecco. Um, um, anyway, I think it's uh, it's delicious. Before I I grab the dessert, I'm going to have another um, German potato salad. I had one already um, last time when I reviewed the um, Air France lounge here at Frankfurt Airport. If you haven't watched the video um, yet, check it out. Here is the link. Yeah, indeed, that, that's a great potato salad. Mm. If you get a chance to try one, then do it. Sherry, cream, and the muesli. So let's try it out. Mm. The Lufthansa lounges are like Germans. Nice but boring. <laughs> I don't know if you... If you agree, but that's, I, I found this quite funny.
course, before I leave the lounge, yeah. wanna try a German beer. Bex is a very um, popular, famous brand here in Germany. So it's dwarf beer, you can get it yourself. And um, yeah, it tastes great. And that is also a good timing to wrap up my lounge review. So um, let's start with um, personal. Personal is um, overall friendly. Um, no concerns at all. Um, give them four points. Um, cleanliness. Um, I can see the personal cleaning up, uh, swiping over the tables when a guest leaves. So that's um, great. I tested out the uh, bathroom, which was clean. And um, um, so cleanliness five five stars. And um, food and drinks. They have all different kinds of liquor, beer, wine, Prosecco, um, sparkling wine, soft drinks. They have um, a few snacks. Um, so um, what I didn't like so much is that they only offered one uh, warm option. Uh, well, one or two. If they can add one or two more options, then this would be nice. And so in terms of food and drinks, I give them Let's give them four points because I really like the quality um, and I like the bags. And what's the last point? Uh, facilities. Um, so the lounges, the size of the lounges is, is quite okay, though it's uh, very busy and um, <clears throat> you um, have to um, keep in mind that Lufthansa, they have several lounges here in Frankfurt and um, so there's not one big lounge like in Doha. Um, there are several smaller lounges. Yeah, I think the design it's 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 modern, and they have these great views over the apron, and they have even showers. They have these uh, phone cabins, um, and yeah, plenty of seating. These high top tables with um, and they have these communal tables over there. Then they have these couches here. Um, I would give them, let's give them, I'd give them four stars. So in total, we would be at 17 stars. And um, I think this is a quite a good um, score. I recommend this, uh, the Lufthansa lounges, the business class lounges. Um, even better if it's not that full and you get great German beer. So guys, before I close this video, this is very, this is really a historic day today because as you can see in the background, I, I just landed here in BER, Berlin Airport. And I was supposed to land at this airport in 2012, which is nine years ago. Can you even imagine? So I'm talking about Berlin Airport in two weeks and um, please stand by. I'm going to review the Lufthansa uh, lounge here at BER Airport. Thank you for watching and uh, see you in two weeks.